Just look at this goodness, guys, from the Kirkland brand at Costco. It's a paella style risotto. Just be. In today's video, I'm going to be preparing the Kirkland brand risotto style paella and I'm also going to give you my honest thoughts on the product as well. First and foremost, I was really impressed by the ingredients list. There's like chicken, shrimp, sausage, rice, onion, red bell pepper, seasonings, red wine vinegar, like so many good flavors in the product and natural flavors too. And straight off the bat, one thing that I liked was that the salt was near the middle of the ingredient list. Gotta love that. So that tells me straight off the bat, it's not gonna be salty, which I can stand with most prepared foods, is that they are salty. So for this time, I'm just gonna prepare half of it, just a quick lunch for Hubs and myself. So here we are, I've got it on the stove. The stove is on six, and I'm just gonna heat this through for about 10 minutes. My paella is done. Looks so good, guys. Look at that. Time for my taste test. Taste the shrimp first. Something tells me I'm gonna need hot sauce, so I've got some hot sauce right here. Mmm, it's really good. Straight off the bat, just from tasting the shrimp, I am gonna give this paella risotto a 10 out of 10. It's really good. Let me just mix her up. Try sausage. Mmm, really delicious, guys. On the instruction, it says to cook on medium heat for four to seven minutes. No, that's a no-go. It took me 10 minutes to prepare this, and what I also did, I added a teaspoon of water, and then I covered it for the first six minutes or so, then I took off the lid, let it steam a little bit more for the other four minutes, and then I stirred everything together. Mmm. This is a win. That's what I paid. So for the $16.82, it's just me and Hubs in the house, and I feel like this is four portions, depending on how much you eat. So it's, so it's averaging about $4.20 a portion. You can't beat that because the ingredients taste really fresh. There's some chicken. Not only can you have the paella style risotto for dinner or lunch, but let's say you can also pack it in your lunch for work and it tastes like you're having a restaurant meal. So I imagine if you packed it for work, you would just follow the instructions on the microwave that you have at work. And typically I would say maybe you could microwave this for four minutes and you should be okay. Mmm, really good. And the hot sauce made a difference. Right now I've got the grace the great, very hot pepper sauce and a tomato base. 
Will I be buying this again? Absolutely. Because typically, typically what would happen is that on a Friday, I do like takeout. And I usually get Guyanese style Chinese food. And by the time I order the wings, the fried rice, the Cantonese chow mein, it's like $45. When this pear style risotto is under 20, and I really don't have to go out of my way to purchase it. Mm. I'm back and my risotto paella is finished. <laughs> it's so good. It's taking everything out of me not to go eat hubby's portion. Half of it's already gone, but if you see this product in Costco, do pick it up. It's very, very good. And there I've got the other half left. There's, I have, oh my fridge, my fridge is open, one second. I also feel like I can prepare the risotto paella in the oven if I wanted to. That might be quicker than on the stove top. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the second half out of this foil container and I'm gonna put it in a Corel like um, from freezer to oven bakeware dish because I am gonna freeze the rest. And next week what I'll do is I'll just take it out of the freezer the night before, put it in the fridge, and then I'll prepare the whole thing in the oven instead. It's a really good value for the quality of the food. I can actually taste all the seasonings in there, the garlic, the onion, everything had a nice flavor. And it's a big win for me when I can have prepared foods or processed foods that are not salty. And this one was not salty at all because as I read to you earlier, the salt is way, way, way down in the list of the ingredients. So again, this Kirkland brand risotto style paella is a win. I'll be buying it again and again and again. And as I said, especially on a Friday night when I feel like having takeout, this is way less expensive. I'm already in the supermarket. I don't have to go out of my way. And whatever I don't use, I can freeze, which is awesome. Comment down below, guys, and let me know if you've seen this product in Costco, if you tried it, if you saw it, would you try it? But again, love, love, love. It's a 10 for me. video thanks for watching and i'll catch up with you in the next one way to stay in prayer meditating and taking time away